Oh, okay. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to the Evil Within. In the last part, we went in and some kind of graveyard. We encountered some new enemies that we've never seen before. These big, tall, kind of giant looking guys with um, long arms swinging around. And um, we, we killed them and then we jumped down a hole. And as we jumped down the hole in the cemetery, because there was a dead end to where we were heading, we got brought back here again with the nurse. Now, I don't know if there's anything different here. Probably not. Okay guys, there's nothing down here, we're going to jump back into the mirror. I just did an upgrade for increased uh, maximum life. So let's jump back in the mirror and see where we end up. Should be in a hole in the cemetery, probably like a tomb somewhere, here we go. Look how we jumped down and fell on our head. <laughs> kind of made a mistake right there. So is Joseph next to us? He should be. Yeah. You don't need to worry about me. Okay, so we fell from up there. That was a risky jump. We can't even see the top of it. We just it's jumped a in. Harder to move lately. What did you say? Does it seem a little harder to? This this must stink. This shit right here. Oh, there's people inside there. Is it a, is it a, a bad zombie? Should I hit it? I think I just killed the guy! <laughs> Shit! I probably shouldn't have done that. Can I pick up this hammer? Come on. Doesn't look like I can. So we've got a lot of swinging um, body bags. That doesn't look too um, too cool. Nah, what have we got? We're, we're like in some kind of prison it looks like. It looks like a tomb because it's underneath a cemetery. What the f is that? That's just another bag, isn't it? Another body bag. It looks like a, like a scorpion. <laughs> Alright, so they're getting picked up. That is gory shit right there. That is twisted. Alright, those levers just moved. There's now spikes. Alright, so... What the, what the hell did you get in here, guy? So it looks like we need to um, play with these levers and maybe open up the path ahead. But before we do that, what have we got that like, could be dangerous around here? I mean, there's... What was that noise? This guy on the floor, he looks like he's still alive. Alright guys, so let's see what these levers do. Is that a pattern on the wall? Maybe that's a clue to what Maybe we... This writing. Doesn't mean anything to me, should it? Hold on a second, I jotted something down earlier. What did you jot down? So is this going to help tell us which levers to pull in a certain order? Maybe? The sacrifices need to be lowered onto the proper altars, and the safe way to him will be open. They need to be put on the proper altars and the safe way to him. So who's him? <laughs> so are the patterns on the um, the altars that are different to each other? It doesn't I think they're all the same, aren't they? So I don't really know if there's an order I need to do. do let's just pull a lever and see what happens. Seven. That's a seven, right? Now, is there a pattern on the wall that looks like that? Yeah, the bottom right one. Okay, so do, what do I do with the rest of the levers if that's open now? Do I have to play with them? Actually, guys, you know what I think this is? The numbers on the um, the altars, some of them are crossed out. Like three of them are crossed out. Three, five, and nine are all crossed out, and seven isn't. So maybe if we put the bodies down to the, the ones that are crossed out and leave seven alone, that could be the answer. Let's try that. Okay. I heard something. So seven is the only one that is not lowered now, seeing as that's not crossed out. So this guy is this guy alive? Should I hit him? He's dead. He's dead. Okay. So the guy Joseph just said he heard something when I did that properly. So let's try this now. Maybe it's locked into place so we can go through. Uh, run. <laughs> okay, we made it. That's good. Now what the fuck is this? <laughs> Oh, 
Huh. Okay. So. Is this a... Yeah, this is like a lift we can jump in now. So let's take this to wherever for some strange reason. I thought, oh god. This can only get worse. It says as well that we need to take the path to him. So there's going to be a big, like, um, butcher guy or something at the end. He's going to be a, a nightmare. He's going to be a bullet sponge. So we've got some kind of medical section right here. What have we got? we got some, oh god, some like tubes right there. Some Someone's making a brain. There's a bag on the floor, probably got a body inside. Let's pick up the pistol ammo. Pick up the health injection. Nah, what else have we got? we got a, a cemetery lab note. There's a lot of shit in there. Just about when the serum was administrated. Vital signs stabilized, sleeping is in short intervals. So whoever's doing this, they're testing on someone with injections. Okay, what is that one? That is a gargantuan. <laughs> Alright, so, so we've cleared the place out for loot, so let's push on. Alright, I'm hearing some noises right here. Let's turn the flashlight off. Alright, we got something around this. Ooh. Okay. So it looks like there's a cage here, and this is where the, the test subject is. Where this guy is putting the serums into it. Yeah, what is that? It looks like a car crash. Oh, he's got a vagina face. Look at that face. It's like... Teeth. Ugh. Okay. Are we not saying what the fuck at all? Are the characters just going to ignore that? They're not going to respond to what they're looking at? Has he got like... He's got like a wolf body. Yeah, he's got a wolf body. What the fuck? So, let's see if we got some kind of special door right there. Maybe stand on this and it'll open the door. Here we go. Can we make a run for it? Okay, we're in. There's no... Um, it's probably going to close... Yeah, it's close behind us. What's that? What was that? We go at the gate. Can you get it open? Why can't I get it open? Is it locked? Oh, okay. <laughs> the fuck is that? <laughs> his eye and his neck has got a mouth. Okay, are we gonna fight this ship? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's shoot this shit then. Is that Joseph? Is he down? Can we help him up? Can we help him up? Doesn't look like... Oh, God. So this guy runs through the bushes. Can we make a break into the gap? In the fence. Let's pick up the shotgun ammo. Can we get in there? Can we get in there? There's a gap. Come on, you can jump in there. Wait. All right, man. Come on, I got this. I got this. Ah, oh, shit. Can you roll in this game? If I double top L1, does that roll? I don't think you can roll. Well, I don't know how to roll, at least. So if he comes at me, I'm going to sprint out the way. There he is. Okay. There must be a button to I've never rolled before. Surely, if you press... Oh, come on. Well, yep, okay, this is going, this is going well. I can't avoid that shit. I need to heal. Ugh. 
Um, is it dead? It went all weird. I think it's dead. Just wasted the rest of my bullets that I had left. Okay. Joseph. That fight is strange, because he just jumps out the bushes over and over again, and you can't avoid it. I mean, I'm sure you can roll in this game. I think I've seen it in, like, trailers and stuff. But I cannot for the life of me figure it out. Oh, we've left stuff behind as well, ammo and stuff. What is it? I dropped my glasses back there. <laughs> oh. No. <Fuck>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go back and get them, have we? You know, I'd love to get that ammo. We can actually- Do I have to go back and get his glasses? Do I have to go back and get your glasses? Is that what you're telling me I have to do right here? I have to go back and get his glasses, don't I? <laughs> what? Okay, this is going to be fun. Let's heal up first. Can't. <laughs> Got none left. So we try just pick up the ammo as well. We can get- If we- so the glasses are over. <laughs> I think that's what I need to do anyway, because this guy can't see without his glasses. There's the doggy. Alright, if we can get him to just not attack us for a sec. I'll draw it away so you can search. I can see where they are. Alright, he's jumped in the bushes, that means he's gonna come out and get me. So we got Joseph's glasses, get to pick up the ammo as well, because we're gonna need that in the future. Alright, his, his attention's over there. So um is a box over here as well, I think he can smash? Oh no, maybe I'm mistaken. There's nothing over here. So, um, what do we do? Let's get his attention oh, back to us. There's nothing to pick up here, so... It looks like the dog's actually... Oh, okay. Oh, we actually evaded it that time. Let's get in, get in the thing, get the thing, get the thing. Go, 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 go. Get in! Yeah! Took no damage. Like a boss. Whew. Here's your glasses. It's not just about being unable to see. It's about... Normal. <laughs> it's all right. Let's focus yeah. on finding Kidman. It's about feeling normal, you know, like emotions and stuff. Like you know, what the fuck? So this guy right here, this beast thing, this can bounce through brick walls, but I can't get past the fence, a gate. Jeez, Joseph, all that for a pair of glasses? Yeah. All right, we've seen Kidman go in here with Leslie. So, let's just search around these corners first. Alright, so we're going to jump inside this church that we've been looking at for a while now. And hopefully Kidman's going to be inside. Okay, so it's the end of chapter 6. That doggy was the boss at the end of it. I think at the end of each chapter there is a boss. And that was the boss for that one. So, we'll actually jump into the ne next chapter in the next video. So, thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time. Bye!